to begin installing the HEPA cart, lay the blue base of the tent next to the cart. With the wheels of the cart locked, pull the blue base of the tent onto the top of the cart. Line the corners of the base up with the corners of the cart. Place the base frame of the unit on top of the blue tent base. Take care to perfectly align the corners now as they cannot be adjusted later. Make sure the white velcro strip is not wedged under the frame. Next, slide the frame poles into the base, pulling the metal button on the base of the frame to secure them in place. The black handles of the frame poles need to be pointed inwards. One frame pole has a green dot. Align that green dot above the green dot on the base of the frame. Now place the top of the frame onto the frame poles. There are four rubber inserts on the frame where the frame poles are pushed into place. Push down on the frame very hard until you feel it pop into place. Next, toss the bulk of the tent over the top of the frame. It's easiest to first get the top of the tent over, then focus on pulling the sides of the tent over and around the frame. With at least one side of the tent around the frame, pull the far side of the tent over the top of the frame. With the tent and frame now in place, use the spring-loaded levers to raise the height of the HEPA tent to its desired level. This is easiest to do by alternating sides. The optional negative air machine caddy slides into place, completing a full mobile containment unit. For more information about mobile containment units, including purchase and rental options, visit Builders Site Protection and Northwest Abatement Rental.